Hello and welcome to the Tinker Cards video gallery. Today we're going to do some multicolored uh, water watercolor effect stamping using the Misty and stamps by Visible Image. And the Visible Image stamps that I'm using are Rays of Light, which I've already stamped here on my um, piece of card, and Angels. And I'm using the large angel uh, for the watercolour effect stamping. So what I've already done is with my Misty, I've sort of pre-stamped the rays of light and the little, um, oh, what are these called again? The Let's just call them orbs, those sort of light distortions that you sometimes can get if you look it up against the light. And we're going to do something similar to this. So you can see I've got the rays behind and then the bottom just is a different sentiment. It's not one from a visible image. And we're going to do the angel now in this little video. So I've used um, Stampin' Up Colours, Daffodil Delight, Melon Mambo and Tempting Turquoise. And the idea is that it all nicely sort of like blends in to each other. And Stamping the race, I wasn't too bothered about it being perfect in the center because as you see the angel will be above and part of it will blend into um, the turquoise and the pink anyway. So let's just go with it. So I'm using my Misty because um, I'll be doing the stamping in stages. Um, and I'm going to start with the Daffodil Delight and I just put a little bit on the feet. So a bit lower down just do that and in the original one I didn't spritz it with water I'm just going to very lightly mist this here just lightly and before stamping I'm going to get rid of the water around the stamp because I don't want that there so I'm just going to lift the misty over and stamp the first bit and I haven't got the heavy duty magnets, but if I put it up back into my corner, it's exactly the same and it should just stay in place properly. So next is going to be the um, Melon Mambo. So let's just... add something there. And again, spritz it very lightly with water. So I'm using uncoated, just plain thick cardstock. I'm not using any particular watercolour card. So just give it a good little spritz. So that might have been a little bit much, but uh, we'll just see. And again, move it across and stamp. And already you can see how it's starting to run. So I'm just going to dab this dry now because I don't want the stamp to get too wet. And then I come in with the turquoise. So I'm having the turquoise here a bit quickly. Just let me put that to another side here. And uh, I'm just going to very lightly spritz just the center of it. I don't really want the hands to get too uh, wet because the water will just travel al along the uh, stamp anyway. So and then pull it over again and stamp and lift off and there you go. So that's the effect and it's quite nicely a sort of running down and it's starting to mix now turning into purple and whatever so you're getting all these really nice lovely colors so you only got a little bit of yellow in there because probably i spritzed the pink a bit more than i did in in the other one so that's that you got a couple of splashes but that doesn't matter because it's a really it's meant to be like a very loose artsy type of card and that's it. All that is left to do now is allow it to dry, stamp your sentiment and then mount it on your base card. So I'll just get you the original card again. What is it? So this was my original card 
and every single one that you stamp will be slightly different so have fun thank you for watching and have a lovely day and if you like my little video tutorial then just put a like on again against it and well have a lovely weekend and thank you for watching bye